Okay, hello and welcome. And then I like to show that how I can adjust my Toyota Corolla's drive belt if this drive belt keeps this yelling sound. An idea is that the first step is to take this this plastic cover out and it opens so that when I take my hands in here and in here and then I lift up and this cover opens in that way. And then when we look in here, there is this important thing that in that area there is alternator and this is this adjusting bolt where we can adjust this drive belt. Okay, and this adjusting happens so that that I need to only do so that first there is this locking bolt is in here. I, I need to release that bolt in here. Let's go to look at first. But what it looks like it is in there, but better good. Yes, there is this bolt and this is 12 millimeter bolt and first I release that bolt and this release means that then when this bolt is free and open I can start to rotate that that bolt and when this bolt goes in that direction then this belt becomes fastened and remember that that this belt must be in I check next. And then when we fasten that bolt so that we rotate that 12 millimeter bolt in that direction and it means that then this alternator moves in that position and then this belt becomes fasten and the, this belt must be so loosened that when I press that in here in my one or two fingers it must be go down in like half centimeters and this is normal pressing like a couple of kilos force and because if this is too tight this belt then this alternators bearings damage and then we need to purchase new alternator and remember to check al always that, that that can can we press that and then there is good rule that if we can rotate that belt about half distance in that way then it's also fine find this belt tightness and now now it seems that, that I can rotate that just in like half amount okay and it's like a little bit proper it, it, it is good that it rotates in that way and a little bit I can I can adjust this in that way. And this belt tightness is fine. Okay, and then, then we continue. Okay, and then I'd like to show to you that how to check this Toyota Corolla car's drive belt status. And now I am talking that belt. And the check means that, that we we'll first look this outer area that it looks similar than that one and then especially this inner area it's the it's the key that we look in that inner area we we must do, do so that we look in that area in here and we can actually this is so tight that it is difficult to paint but we can check that area that it is all areas very similar than that one and in this drive belt there can't be any any holes or missing part this is so critical part because it it rotates this water pump and then this alternator and if this goes broken our cars running ends within about in 30 minutes or one hour and that's it's good to check that this belt looks like in that one because this is almost new original Toyota belt and let's look at if we can see more 
Okay, and this area is this inner area is important. And also, this outer areas must be similar than that one. And there is, by the way, this joint. There is this well welding in here. Interesting. But this this look especially on this inner area. Okay, cool. And this was this dry belt inspection.